In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect Bluetooth mouse without USB receiver. So in case you have lost your USB receiver, here's what you can do with the mouse. The first step would be to kind of pick up your mouse and simply turn it on. So it has a power on and power off button, make sure to power it on. If it does not have a separate a pairing button on there, simply don't press it, just turn the mouse on. But if it does have a pairing button, click that one as well. Now, once the mouse is in pairing mode, you want to go to search here on your Windows computer and type in Bluetooth and then click on Bluetooth and other device settings. In here, what you want to do is first, of course, turn on your Bluetooth on your computer. So you want to click on up here and then you want to press add device. In here, you want to click the first option, which is Bluetooth, and it says audio devices, mice, keyboards, phones, pens, controllers, and more. Press this and simply wait for it to appear. So as it says, you have to make sure the device is turned on and discoverable, and you will then have to select the device below to connect. Now, once this mouse is found, you can simply press it and you can connect to it, and hopefully it will work for you. If it asks you for a password, you can look around the mouse or around the box in which you got the mouse because the password may be there. If you have a specific brand and you can't find the password, but your computer is asking you for the password, you can try contacting their customer service or the store you bought the mouse at. They will most likely help you and let you know what the code is. So if you, if you simply can't find this device over here, if you can't find the mouse, this probably means you don't have a Bluetooth mouse, but you have a Wi-Fi mouse. And if you have a Wi-Fi mouse, unfortunately, without the USB connector, without the dongle, um, your mouse is pretty much unusable. So this only works for Bluetooth mice, as I said, and hopefully yours was found and you can now start using it. I hope this video helped you out, and if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.